template.com. In this video, uh, we're going to show you how to uh, create side menus on our website. Um, and this is uh, the instructor here, Charlie G. So let's take a look at uh, how we're going to install these side menus. So on the basic page, we just have this, you know, we have our top menu here, but we want to make this site look a little more professional. Uh, we want some side menus along the left hand side here. And we can actually have them on both sides. I'll show you how to do that. Um, so let's go back and let's go to our uh, back end and uh, we're going to want to create some articles. Uh, so let's create some articles here. So we're going to call this uh, new new t-shirts uh, and some dummy text here uh, we're going to do save and new popular popular t-shirts some dummy text Save and new. Do wild, wild and crazy T-shirts. There's a dummy text in there. Do a save and close. Uh, those are all in the homepage um, uh, category. Um, so let's go and, uh, let's go to our menu and we're going to create a new, new menu. We're going to call this, um, side menu. Save and close. And let's go into the side menu and let's make some menu items to hook up the articles. So we're going to do menu item type, select, we're going to go single article, and pick uh, new t-shirts, call this new t-shirts, and it's in the right menu location there. Save and new. Go do it again. Uh, we made three articles here, so we're on article number two. Popular T-shirts. Uh, okay. Save and new. Let's do it one more time. So single article, and uh, wild and crazy t-shirts. Um, okay, save and close. So now we have our menu items all set up. Now we just have to connect them to our module. So uh, let's create a new module here. Um, again, it's going to be a menu module. Um, and let's call it um, side menu module. Uh, we're going to hide the title. We don't want that title. Uh, the select your menu. We're going to do side menu. That's the uh, menu we created. Um, and we want it on all the pages. Uh, select the position. Again, go, go up to every top here and collect JS Optimus. Click the template that you're using. And it will sh just give you all the um, module positions for your template. And uh, we're going to click on sidebar one. This will be on the left hand side of your uh, template. Uh, 
and let's do save. Let's go back to our website, click refresh. There you go. We have our side menu. New t-shirts, popular t-shirts, wild and crazy t-shirts. Click on it, I'll bring it to your page. Um, now, uh, a lot of people like to have a login form uh, with their website. I'm not going to talk about it today. I'm just going to show you how um, one comes with your default on Joomla. So let's activate it and then put it on the right-hand side of your uh, page, your website. So it's right here, the login position. Actually, it's already activated, but it's in a position that's not um, with my compatible with my um, template. So let's go into this login form. And let's just create another, let's just put it to another position. Uh, let's put it on uh, sidebar two, which is going to put it on the right hand side. Um, and okay, let's do save and close. And let's see, now you can refresh it. And now you have your login form over on the right hand side of your page. And as you can see, the web page is coming more together and it just looks a little better at having these menu items on the side here. Um, but that's it for today, or right, this, this uh, video. Um, check back and look at the rest of our videos too um, as we go deeper into creating a website. Again, this, website was, this uh, video was brought to you by website-template.com. Thanks for watching.